whisk together a quarter cup of tapioca starch with two and a half cups of water. You want to make it into a slurry. So you'll know it's ready when it's no longer white. It turns clear. I have this over medium heat. It's a process, but this is your thickening agent like this. See the difference? It's like a translucent versus a white. This is ready. All right, next step. All right, now I pour this into my container. Grab me a container of soft tofu and dump that in. This is how you're going to make a fat-free dressing have both protein and be creamy. Next is the magic. This stuff is accidentally vegan. And I'm going to use half of this, only the one side of it, and put that in next. Whee! Get all the tasty out. Grab your immersion blender, do it in a blender, do it by hand, whatever it takes, but next you blend. And voila, you have quick and easy, creamy, fat-filled, nope, fat-free <laughs> salad dressing that you can use every day and indulge with lots of it and not feel deprived. And it's got a kick of protein because of the tofu. Ta-da! You could do that with pretty much any seasoning. I just happen to really, really like the Uncle Dan's. It's very nostalgic for me because my mom passed away in 97, he used to use it to make um, dip, so veggie dip. So it's a very nostalgic thing for me. I was a little excited to find out that it was accidentally vegan. Um, used to That particular flavor used to be called Uncle Dan's Old Southern. Um, now it's Creamy Dill. But it is the same flavor and it is freaking delicious. So there you go. That is my salad dressing and it's amazing and it's so stupid easy. If you like things like this, let me know and I will continue making uh, videos showing you my tips and tricks. Now, if you want to measure it in my fitness pal, what you do is you put the recipe in under recipes, you build the recipe out, and then you weigh how much product you end up with, and you put the grams of that as how many servings it is. That way you can pour out however much you want and however many grams you've poured out, that's how many servings you put it as. Does that make sense?